Honey Heart C. Welcome back to Star Stable. Today is gonna be a great day because I am finally going to pick up the two tinkers that were just released on Wednesday. I'm really excited about this. So they released three of the colors. So let's hop on down. So this is the gray one right here. How beautiful is she? She's really, really pretty. She's absolutely gorgeous. Look at how cute she is. They went all out with these. They did such an amazing job. Okay, so the Tinker Breed. It says there is magic in the air when you see a majestic tinker trotting over a field. Yes, it's mane and feathering blowing in the wind is everything that makes these horses so, so special. So they are 850 star coins. Oh, she's got like a little kissy spot on her lip. Oh, cute. She is cold tolerant. So that means you can take her to Dino Valley. Of course, she's going to look beautiful in the winter Christmas world. I have to buy her. Buy horse. Hot Strawberry. Okay, here we go. This is the most challenging part is picking the name. Hero Bullet. Amethyst Spider. Green Whisper. Daisy Dew. Dreamstone. Ooh, Frost Queen. Frost Queen is a really nice name. It kind of sounds like Frosting. All right, what else do we have? We've got Air Bean. Obsidian Song. Morning Galaxy. Heavy Frost. Ooh, I like that name too. Too. Heavy Frost. I think we're gonna go with Heavy Frost with her. Her body looks like it's been heavily frosted. All right, congratulations on your new horse. All right, she is all mine. Hello, Heavy Frost. I'll save the name Frost Queen probably for the white one that they're coming out with. I think that would be a good name. I love the name Heavy Frost for her because let's check her out. Let's look at her body again. Really heavily, heavily dappily, kind of frosted. Her mane, she has so much hair. Let's hop on her. And let's walk her over here and let's check out all the different manes for her because I also heard that you can actually change out like their little beards so you can actually give her a beard. First of all, her mane is thick, gorgeous, beautiful. Same thing with her tail. She's pretty much perfect. I mean, I, pr I don't know if I'm gonna change very much on her, but you can add in different hairstyles. So here's the first one, nice and short. Looks like her tail didn't change at all. It really shortens. I mean, she looks like a different horse. That doesn't even look like a tinker. You can give her braids. Oh, she's pretty cute with the braids. Braids. Shortened up her tail a little bit. It kind of like didn't make it as thick. So she's really pretty like that. All right, then we've got this one. So whenever you throw her mane over to one side, still kind of shortens it up just a bit. And we've got this one. So still kind of a long mane, but still keeps it on one side. All right, what is this one? Am I seeing a difference? Maybe I'm not seeing a difference with this one. So short, norm. Oh, it adds the little goat piece. Okay, see, look at her little beard. She's got like a little icy beard under her. <gasps> I think I'd need that. All right, so it keeps her regular style, but adds a little goat piece. Then this one, it's the same styles. It's just the same styles now with the little beard. I don't know why I'm calling it a goat piece. It's because it reminds me of a goat that goats have them, but it's a little beard piece. So here she is with the braids with the beard piece. And then with the style mane. Oh, she's really cute. Okay, do I like the beard? I think I do like the little beard that you can add on to her. I mean, since her name is Heavy Frost, I mean, she would be completely frosted that she would have like a little beard to keep her warm. That's how like shaggy her fur is. And it looks like little icicles hanging down. I wish these hairstyles that you could constantly change them out, that if you purchase them, you can constantly change them. You know, like how you are with your rider. I really like the beard. Okay, I'm gonna still think about it though. Again, she's pretty perfect the way she is. So let's, let's get some tack on her. Mm, throw on the saddle pad a little Western saddle, bridle. And of course I have to take my little snoozy sleepy kitty cat with me. So put a saddle bag and put the sleepy snow cat in there. And we'll put this little crown right there on her head. Perfect. And it gives her like a little holiday festive flair. All right, let's go take her for a little spin and see what she is like. Look at that. Oh, I think they just did a perfect job with her. Let's let's go take her out for a little test ride. I want to take her over to the Winter Village. I think I'm going to be obsessed with these, which I knew it. I knew I would be. I knew I would totally be obsessed with them to the Winter Village. I want to see what she looks like in the snow. All right, here we are. Yeah, she fits in with the environment perfectly. Let's go down this little slide here. Whoop, there we go. Oh, slide into a stop. <laughs> She's so perfect. What a gorgeous horse. Ugh. She might be my favorite just for the fact with those dapples and just look at the shading. It's just, just got, oh, look at there's two people over there riding. There they are running past. So she named hers Cloud Aura. So pretty. Oh, and here's the other one. Again, we all have our tinker horses. Hers is named Moon Moon. And she looks like a deer. I wonder if I should take her over and try to get the Yule goats. Let's see how she does on, on the ice. Have her run on over. Look at her, even like whenever she's snorting, she's got like a little bit of like cold coming from her nostril. 
Yep, she can slide. <laughs> I love how she slides. Whenever she slides, it almost looks like her whole entire hindquarters like goes down. Okay, maybe it doesn't go as low as I thought, but still, super cute. Should I get my cat out for this too? All right, let's have little Snoozy come out. So let's pick up some presents. Let's let's chase after some Yule goats that have kind of gone wild on the ice. Oh, there it is. There it is. Go after, catch that Yule. Okay, got it. Wow, what about this one? Turn around. Oh, she's sliding. She's sliding. She's, don't run over my cat. Don't run over Snoozy. Those hooves are big. There's another Yule Goat. Oh, she did not like that one. That one really upset her. Sometimes the Yule Goats, whenever they just come flying out of the presents, they really scare the horses. She's sliding. She's sliding. Oh, got it. All right, one more. Please don't glitch. Please don't glitch. Sometimes the Yule Goat quest does glitch out and then I have to like restart my game and then come back over here. All right, sliding, 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 sliding. <laughs> I love the sliding. Oh, I love this horse. That thick mane. Her mane is so thick. Okay, got all the Yule Goats. That was really easy. It, that just went really smoothly. I'm hoping I'll have enough Winter Wish Spirits in order to get the prizes from the Wish Shop. Still have quite a ways to go, and I've been collecting them every single day, but I've got a ways to go, even though I almost have 100 Wish Coins. I think it's safe to say I am in love with these horses. She's so pretty. Oh, that little kissy spot on her. Oh, <gasps> oh. Seriously, I do love this one. I love this one a lot. Okay, so I'm obsessed with her. So now let's go and get the other color. Look at this gorgeous beauty too. Now for some weird reason, this one reminds me the most of Treat, even though the coloring is still a bit off. Ugh. Look at that. Look at the way that Star Stable did these. These are dreamy. Like these are like dream horses. That's kind of what they should have called them. Like meet the tinker dream horses because you're going to fall in love with them. These horses should come with a warning because they're so pretty. Okay. So I definitely have to pick up this gorgeous beauty. So again, 850 star coins. All right. Shade Dust, Shade Disco, Charmborn, North Harmony. That's a pretty good name. Caramel Pie. This horse looks like a caramel pie with heavy whipped cream. All right, caramel pie, bye. And we will send this one to my stable. Congratulations on your new horse. All right, perfect. So let's go on over to my stable and check out caramel pie. Oh, that name is making me really hungry. All right, Caramel Pie, where are you? Let's take a little look. There they are right here. Oh, look at my cat is like flying. Oh, look at that. My cat is not even sitting on the ground. It's a f magical floating cat. All right, Snoozy, I don't know how you did that. Seriously, I'm thinking whipped cream and caramel and that is not a bad thing. I'm gonna be obsessed with these horses. I don't know how Star Stable can create anything prettier than these horses. I mean, they're just so pretty. All right, Caramel Pie, let's take this buddy out and. And let's actually, let's get some tack. A little peppermint saddle, a little candy cane bridle. I think that works. Oh wait, I gotta go over to Heavy Frost. I need my saddle pad and I need my cat. Saddle pad on, saddle bag, and snoozy. All right, now we're ready for a ride. They have a beautiful walk. We should go take him up to the arena. Let's go take him up to the training arena that's up here. And then we can really get a really clear, good look at all of his gates. Perfect. We've got this paddock all to ourselves for training. Really sweet. All right, let's kick it up to a walk. And we kind of already saw, gosh, those feet are so feathered. I'm surprised he doesn't step on his own feathering. Trot, there we go. Really high, proud trot. They need a little paddock arena in the Christmas village. I look kind of silly, like dressed like Santa in the regular world. I really miss the snow world. All right, now let's pick it up to a canter. Oh, easy, easy. Nice little canter. There we go. Very slow canter. How much is like main moves? All right, and then a full on gallop. Beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous horse. So gorgeous. All right, and then jumping. <laughs> he looks so beautiful jumping. All right, let's go and check out all the different hairstyles for this one. See what he looks like with maybe a braided mane. So braided mane, gorgeous. Oh, and then look at that blaze. Yes, please. I love it whenever it's not like just a straight blaze. There's a little bit of some character to this blaze. Shorter mane looks pretty good. Looks really good on this coloring. The longer mane, but not the longest also looks pretty good. And then this kind of wild mane. All right, now let's see the little beard. 
Oh, I think the beard works so well with this horse. I don't know what's holding me back from buying it. I should just buy it and just do it, but I'm, I'm like being held back for some weird reason. I don't know why, but I think the beard looks really good on this one. Beautiful, right? Isn't he gorgeous? Yes, he's completely gorgeous, dreamy horse. Still loving his really long mane. There's only one more to go and get, and that one is the one in Fort Pinta. So let's go ride on over there. So this is the last color to get for now. They haven't updated it yet with the other colors. Star Stable just released these three for now, which is really nice because then it doesn't seem to be like such a hit on your star coins. I refreshed my star coins. I bought more in preparation because I knew I would love these tinkers, but it's nice to be able to spend time with like these three before the other ones come out. So here is the other one. It's kind of like that classic, like black and white Tobiano, right? Isn't he really cute? Oh, so pretty. All right, let's take a look. Ooh, the fire. Oh, he's really cute. Oh, he's got two colored eyes. He's got one brown eye and one icy blue eye. And again, the coloring, the way that they did the pattern on these, whoever designed these horses should get a raise because these are so nice. All right, so I kind of have a name already picked out for him, but I'm not 100% sure which one. I know the name that I originally wanted to go with is Arctic Velvet, but I'm thinking maybe there might be a different name. So let's click 850 star coins. He looks really active. He's like, he's ready to be purchased. He's ready. So I'm gonna send him to my stable. Diamond Tea, Cat Hill, Grim Glimmer, Pirate Bow. Sky Cookie. Ooh, he is like an Oreo cookie color. Lady Warrior, Sienna Child. All right, let's play around with Arctic. So I was thinking originally that I was gonna name him Arctic Velvet, which does seem like a really good name for him. Arctic Velvet, Arctic Velvet. You know, it's kind of got that t -t -t. Whenever you like say it, Arctic Velvet. Okay, maybe not. But I was also thinking maybe Arctic Kiss or maybe even Arctic Wish. How do you pick? How do you pick? How do you, how does anyone pick a name? Kind of looks like an Arctic Velvet, like his coat would be super velvety and soft. Arctic Whisper, Arctic Hurricane. Arctic Kiss is really cute. I think I'm gonna go with Arctic Kiss. I don't know, I can't pick a name. It's so hard. The names are so hard to pick. All right, let's come back. I, I know I'm gonna buy him, but let's take out Caramel Pie. We're gonna go over to the Ice World really quick. I want to do another trail ride with these tinkers and I just I'm obsessed with the winter world I'm obsessed with it. I I love it and this will give me time to think is it gonna be Arctic Velvet or Arctic Kiss or Arctic Wish or none of them Ooh, He's going backwards. What is he doing? Okay. All right, let's take him out for a little ride We still have Santa hats to find and I think I already kind of pre saw them over here See right here. All right, so we've got five Santa hats to find in the snow Ooh, There's one here's another Oh, there's one way out here. There's three. Oh, yep, right here. I missed one. So here's number four. Come on, Caramel Pie, find him. Find that last Santa hat. Oh, it's gonna be over here by the lake. It has to be by the lake, right? Yes, okay, perfect. Okay, there's the last one for the day. You found them all. Okay, perfect. So do I know yet which horse I wanna get? So do I know the name yet for him? I don't know, I don't know. Is he gonna be Arctic Velvet or Arctic Wish? I wish this was a live stream so I could ask you guys and you guys could tell me. I mean, Arctic Velvet was the original name I had picked for him, but Arctic Kiss just sounds so cute. I mean, you can't go wrong with any name. There's no way to mess it up. There's no way. It's just whatever name you think just fits best with the horse or whatever name you just kind of like. I think I'm going to go with Arctic Velvet because that's the original name I had picked for him. All right, by horse, Sunny Crush, Crown Promise. No, I should not look at these random names because then I'll get confused and I don't want to get confused. But there's Arctic Kiss right here. Arctic Velvet. All right, we're going with Arctic Kiss. Arctic Kiss, boom, sealed. All right, he's gone. He's in my stable. The kiss has been sealed in the Arctic. Oh, and since I have them out too, here's the difference between the Clydesdale and the Tinker. So Grand Bell is my Clydesdale next to the Tinker, which are they about the same size? Or are the Clydesdales larger? They almost look like they're the same size between the two of them. But man, those Tinkers are just gorgeous because of all their feathering. Even though the Clydesdales have like a longer furrier coat. All right, so there's these two. And here is Mr. Arctic right here. <sighs> Love. He's such a little love bug. Oh, I love that. I love his eye. Oh, he's beautiful. All right, let me go grab my tack for him. We'll do a white bridle, a white saddle, a little saddle pad. And of course, I'm gonna put Snoozy back with me. I don't have any good saddle bags. So here he is, Arctic Kiss. Here he is next to the other two that have been released so far. I'm in love with these. I'm in love with these. That's the only way to describe it. All right, let's take him back to the winter world. Oh wait, first we gotta see the manes on him. We need to see the manes. There's the short one, braided. Semi-short, 
semi-long, and then of course the little beards that you can put on them. Which, am I finally gonna do it? Am I finally gonna buy a beard for him? Let's do it, let's just buy a beard. So I'm gonna buy the beard on his regular mane and tail. So I'm gonna do this one, pay with star coins. All right, done. He's got his little beard on now. Here, does he want a candy cane? He can have a candy cane. He's such a good boy. There you go, help yourself. There we go, good boy. Here we are, winter world. Whoop. Oh, crash. All right, in the winter world here. Man, these, they just look so pretty. They just look so stunning. <gasps> oh, my game crashed. Oh, and we're, we're back to the candy canes. All right, so there we go. There are all three of these gorgeous Tinker horses that have been so far released. Um, I'm, not, I'm not surprised that I love them and that I'm obsessed with them. They are really pretty. I mean, they did such a good job with these. I'm obsessed. It's gonna be such a pleasure to ride them. I can't wait to see the other colors because again, I know I, I'm not gonna be able to resist them because they're so pretty. Did you guys pick up any of these horses? Do you guys have a favorite color out of the three that have already been released? Or are you waiting for one of the other colors? I'd love to know your thoughts in the comments. Subscribe if you're as horse crazy as I am. This is my horse crazy channel and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!